Welcome to the PlastiFab's instructional video on installing Durafoam insulation to provide a continuous layer of thermal insulation for your basement walls, providing added comfort and increased energy savings. In this video, our experts will guide you through the steps we recommend you follow to complete your project successfully. No matter what your level of experience, you can use this video as a guide to getting the best results from your project. Studies have shown that as much as 25% of home heating energy loss can be attributed to lack of insulation on below grade foundations, crawl spaces and under slabs. Applying a continuous layer of Durafoam rigid insulation can help to reduce this heat loss. The following basic steps describe requirements for insulating your interior basement wall with Durafoam insulation. Before installation, ensure that you have reviewed the building code including any regional requirements. The next step is to clean the wall. The surfaces must be clean, dry, and free of foreign materials or sharp protrusions. Measure and trim Durafoam rigid insulation with a utility knife or fine-tuned handsaw, such as a keyhole type or drywall saw, to fit openings such as windows. Starting from a corner, attach Durafoam rigid insulation to the basement wall using an adhesive compatible with expanded polystyrene insulation. Apply the adhesive according to the manufacturer's instructions. To create a moisture barrier, the Durafoam rigid insulation should be tightly butted together. Joints should be no wider than one millimeter. Where the Durafoam insulation functions as both moisture protection for wood framing and interior finishes, and as a vapor barrier in accordance with the code, it shall be applied over the entire interior surface of the foundation wall. Construct a separate wood framed wall to be installed in front of the Durafoam insulation as support for the half inch thick gypsum board. Use at least two by two wood studs for this wall. Place the vertical framing members spaced at 24 inches on center. Fasten the framed wall to the upper floor joist and to the basement floor leaving a small gap between the insulation and the back of the framed wall. Electrical wiring can be placed by running it in the small gap behind the framing. Use shallow electric boxes. Attach half inch thick gypsum board to the face of the frame wall. That's it. Follow these simple how-to steps to install a continuous layer of Durafoam insulation to insulate and create a comfortable basement. Thank you for choosing Durafoam Insulation.